The restaurant run by the family of slain Riverside County Sheriff's Deputy Darnell Calhoun reopened Wednesday morning, February 1st, and the community welcomed the business back with open arms. Calhoun's family Texas Barbecue, closed immediately after the deputy was killed Friday, January 13th. Calhoun was responding to a domestic violence call near Lake Elsinore when the suspected shooter, Jesse C. Navarro, shot and killed him, authorities said. In anticipation of crowds, the family set up tables and chairs in the restaurant's parking lot. Social media posts encouraged well-wishers to bring their own chairs as well. The Washington Avenue business reopened at 11 a.m. An Instagram post from the Calhoun family thanked the community and said the E3 would be open through Saturday, February 4, or until we sell out. It also professed faith in God. Words cannot express how much we've been encouraged to continue to trust the Lord, the post states. Just seeing all of you come alongside our family reminds us that God is in control. A few minutes before the restaurant opened its doors, Darnell Calhoun's mother, Renee Calhoun, said she was waiting for reality to set in. I have been strengthened by my church in the Lord, Renee Calhoun said. And having lots of scripture. She called Wednesday an emotional day, given the details of reopening a business while dealing with the loss of a child. Within six minutes of opening, customers had already been served. Volunteers with black aprons brought black trays stacked with black containers to customers seated in the parking lot as the smell of marinated meat wafted in the air. Mike Mables, 66, and Kelly Mables, 63, who have lived in Marietta for more than 30 years, came out for lunch to support the family in their time of need, Mike Maples said. They plan to order their favorite item on the menu, the brisket. About 30 customers had already arrived, forming a line out the restaurant door. More were expected. It's an amazing community, isn't it? Kelly Maples said. This is amazing. The outpour of support from the community, including cards, flowers and balloons left at the restaurant since the day after the shooting, has been constant. Hundreds attended two vigils for Calhoun, one in Lake Elsinore outside the sheriff's station where he worked and another in Marietta at a park. Both drew huge crowds for events that featured speeches, music and prayers. A GoFundMe page created for the restaurant has almost quadrupled its goal at $10.000. Oh, oh, oh. Another fundraiser, organized by the Riverside County Deputy Sheriff's Relief Foundation, surpassed its goal of $250.000 oh, 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 for the Calhoun family. Also, Calhoun's widow, Vanessa, accepted a mortgage-free home from the nonprofit Tunnel to Towers Foundation, a news release states.